Chich Chich Harbour um, is a really important wildlife site both nationally and also internationally for migrating birds um, and unfortunately the terns are really in decline in the harbour. The numbers of common terns and little terns which are the terns that we're protecting have drastically decreased in the last 10 years. The Return of the Term project is trying to encourage them back into the harbour um, through habitat restoration and hopefully in turn also recovering nature in general. Back in 2021, Natural England published the SSSI condition review which concluded that the state of nature in Chichester Harbour was declining. With the SSSI condition review came some recommendations for how we can turn things around and one of those recommendations was to look at the possibility of a shingle recharge in Chichester Harbour. And then uh, DEFRA, the Department for Environment, Food and Rural Affairs, teamed up with the Heritage Fund to create this new uh, grant programme called the Green Recovery Challenge Fund. So putting all the, the dots together, we realised there was a great opportunity for us if we took what information we already knew and then bid for the funding to do the shingle recharge. So the Conservancy teamed up with the Friends of Chichester Harbour and we put this bid together and then in June, the former chairman, Oliver Chipperfield, said he nearly fell off his chair when the Heritage Fund rung him and said the project was successful. So we were absolutely delighted, but realised that, well, effectively, the real work starts now. So there's four main components of the Return of the Term project. We've purchased five new purposely built turn rafts um, and these are effectively platforms that we have turned into the perfect habitat for terns and we've placed these around the harbour um, and they are already being used by lots of common terns and seem to be really successful. Another part of the project is the small fish surveys. These are population surveys that we are doing around the harbour both at the start and at the end of the terns breeding season and this allows us to understand what the food source is like for the terns and whether this is affecting um, their populations in the harbour. The shingle recharge work is one of the most important parts of the project and it's looking at enhancing our naturally occurring habitats for terns in the harbour and um, so we've identified Stakes Island as one of these habitats and the key here is that the terns are nesting there but unfortunately on a high spring tide they're getting washed away um, so we're really just trying to raise this area by about a metre to really give the terns a chance and hopefully to encourage them to successfully breed. The Nature Recovery Plan is a piece of work where we're looking across the AOMB and beyond at the areas that are already designated and also areas where we can enhance nature. This is a really important piece of work and will go towards creating other nature recovery projects um, and hopefully improving the overall condition of Chichester Harbour. We will monitor the success of this project by continuing to count the number of turns in the harbour and hopefully as we see these increase we'll be able to continue to build up a picture of how the turns are using the harbour and hopefully continue to enhance the habitats um, that we have here. The Friends of Chichester Harbour are effectively a helping hand for Chichester Harbour Conservancy. Our role here is to conserve the harbour, look after the environment, we provide working parties and funds to assist the Conservancy in their work. And this turn project is a case in point. This is one project that we've been involved in but as this project comes to its conclusion we'll be looking for more funds, for more ways to help the harbour, more ways to improve the environment. For future generations this project is going to mean that people will be able to see the terns coming back to the harbour, breeding in the harbour, the numbers increasing. It's really exciting for everybody to be able to see this happening. Yeah, I'm immensely proud of what everyone's been able to achieve with this project. Jess has done incredibly well in her role to coordinate everything and it's really energised the Friends of Chichester Harbour as well and they already want to have conversations about what's, where's the next project, how can we help and getting those success stories really puts a good foundation in place for doing similar work in the future. Being able to watch the Return of the Term project um, develop over the last year has been really exciting and I'm really proud to have been part of it and hopefully in the next coming years see the Terns um, return to the harbour. If you were to ask me where I saw things in five years' time, I would like the Shingle Recharge to be just one of several different projects that we're doing and also to get everybody focused on nature recovery so that everything we're doing is, is benefiting the natural environment of the harbour. People absolutely need to be part of this as well. We would like people to go out and enjoy their walking in the countryside and enjoy their sailing in a beautiful environment. So it's not a case of nature or recreation, the two need to absolutely work together. <laughs>